lot of the scholars agree that the first of the major signs will be the Mahdi. Who is Al Mahdi? Al Mahdi, literally in Arabic, Al Mahdi means in English the awaited one and the anointed one. So the chosen awaited one. His name is Muhammad. You'll find this hadith in Sahih Muslim. Rasul Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam says his name is like my name and his father's name is like my father's name. So his name is Muhammad, the son of Abdullah. And he resembles the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam not in his physical form but in his character. Allah said about the Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam وَإِنَّكَ لَعَلَىٰ خُلُقٍ عَظِيمٍ You, O Muhammad, are on an amazing character. This is Allah witnessing to this. So his character is, is perfect. This man, Al Mahdi, will be, will resemble the character of the Prophet. ﷺ. And he said he will rule and lead the Muslims until he transforms the world. He will fill it with justice and peace as it was filled with injustice and tyranny. So how many years did it take for the world to be in this terror and tyranny now? Al-Mahdi, in only a little while, in a short span of time, by the help of Allah, with his knowledge and with his ability, will change this state of the whole world from injustice to justice, from tyranny to peace, just as it was filled the other way. So every, the balances will be returned with the coming of the Mahdi. And the Mahdi, some scholars say he's born now. The minor signs make it a possibility that he probably is right now here. Al Mahdi, as in Sahih Muslim, you'll find this hadith. And the scholars will identify him with the descriptions that the Prophet ﷺ placed about him. There are certain features about him white forehead, big sharp eyes, thin nose which is slightly hooked on the top. They know his other signs. Some of, other, some of his other signs are the following. So that no one can think Al Mahdi is someone else. He has particular signs. They are all authentic narrations from the Prophet. You'll find them in Sahih Bukhari and Sahih Muslim and the authenticated hadiths. There will be a group of Arabs from within the Jazeera Al Arabiya, from within the Arabian Peninsula, somewhere near Mecca. They will hear about the Mahdi and they will not agree with him. They'll say he is not the real one. And they will come from an eastern direction of Mecca, they'll come in with an army to fight Al-Mahdi. So the first people in Mahdi will fight are Arabs under the banner of Islam. But they've gone wrong. As they are approaching, a group of them, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala makes the earth swallow them. They all die. And a group of them fight him and Al-Mahdi destroys them all. So the first of the Arabs and the companions asked a messenger of Allah. What if among those Muslims who fight him are proper Muslims and they die within that battle like that? What's going to happen to them? Rasul said every one of them will be gathered on the day of judgment on the intentions they died for, even if they were the wrong army.